If you're looking for cheap NBA Live Mobile coins to get the season started right, make sure you check out MMOGO.com and use the code BOBBY at checkout for 5% off your purchase. What's up, ballers? We are back, and Team of the Week has returned to NBA Live Mobile. So as you guys can see, we've got some new Team of the Week players. We got DeMarcus Cousins right here, the 87 overall Team of the Week master. Um, I'm not sure I really understand the set a whole lot. You have to turn in... 10, 10 elite team of the week players for one 87 overall player and the 87 overall player isn't even auctionable like i'm just honestly ea has ceased to make any sense to me about anything anymore uh, let's see new packs we got team of the week packs which can obviously only be purchased with cash you can also buy them with credit or whatever rep you can buy them with rep but you need to play like 50 head-to-head -head games to have enough rep to buy one of them. Let's see. Actually, it costs uh, 50,000 and you get 300 rep per head-to-head -head game. So you would actually need to play 150 head-to-head -head games to have enough rep. Here's some of the other elite players. we got Aaron Gordon, Otto Porter. All right. Somebody explain to me how we don't have a James Harden or a LeBron James. They both scored 56 plus. Where are their cards right now? Before we get started, we do have some subscriber shoutouts, so I'm going to put those up there. Shout out to everybody on the notification squad. If you guys want a chance at being in one of those shoutouts, make sure you subscribe down below and turn on notifications and be one of the first people to comment on my next video. Anyways, guys, not a lot of bright things happening in NBA Live Mobile right now. But I know you guys want to see the bundle, and even though I know the players that I get out of here are probably going to be unauctionable, it's basically sunk cost, money I'm never going to get back again, I know you guys want to see it. So, we're going to open one bundle just to see if it's worth it. I'm probably not going to do this every week this season because more than likely it's not going to be worth it, and I'll only do it if there's like a special team of the week player that I really want. But here we go. Lots of Team of the Week tokens, it looks like. We get two Paul Millsaps. Okay. Why Why are you going to have a Paul Millsap that's only 70 overall in the game when freaking Ron Baker is an 80 overall? Oh, I just don't get anything that they do anymore, guys. I'm really... Hey, there we go. We get a Dennis Schroeder right there. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so it looks like we are able to pull more than three Team of the Week players. I'm pretty sure that's all we pulled in the last pack. And we finish off the rest of it with just a bunch of tokens. Looks like we're going to be pulling a lot of David Nwabas and Paul Millsaps. Um, I'm guessing those are probably the only two gold Team of the Week players. And it seems like, oh, Jason Tatum is one as well. Uh, but not being very generous with the packs today. If they were going to give us, like, if you're going to make it so these packs are the majority gold players, then, oh, James Johnson right there. Okay, I can take that. If you're going to make it so these are majority gold players, maybe give us some more gold team of the week players rather than having us get, like, tons and tons of gold players that I'm guessing we're not going to be able to sell, although I might be able to throw them into a set. I'm not positive on that one. I am not recommending that you guys open this for sure because... Since these are unauctionable, basically as soon as you open them, that is a complete sunk cost. You're never getting your money back, never getting coins back. It's just going to sit in your inventory and you're going to have to end up one day using it to train players, which is just sad to think about. Dropping that much money on a card and then having nothing that you can do with it, but throw it into a set to train somebody just kind of sucks but hopefully we get it fixed in the future i'm gonna try to stay positive we do have an elite player coming at the end i believe for our topper let's see all right still not getting a whole lot out of here we've gotten one dennis Schroeder so far so overall like i said probably would not recommend buying this set or box or bundle or whatever it's called i can't even remember all right, so we get a Mario Chalmers right there. Nice little backup point guard. Let's see, Jason Tatum and James Johnson again. All right, so we are up to an 80 overall for our franchise, and here we go. Elite Team of the Week, guaranteed player. Please give me something good. 
I believe the best possible one is an 85 overall, unless I was mistaken. I, f I feel like I saw an 88 Giannis somewhere, but I can't remember where. So I could be wrong on that one, but maybe there's a small, small chance that there's an 88 pack Giannis in here somewhere. We're going to see. And three, two, one. We got a no look. Who is it? Give me Giannis. All right. We get an 82 Dom Dom Domantas Sabonis. All right. And that doesn't even boost our overall. Dang it. All right. And we got a free daily chance pack too. So we're going to open that up. I am hoping there are some nice sets that we can use with these gold players. If not, there is... Okay, 20 gold players for an elite player. So we can actually do this a couple times. Okay, okay, okay. Actually, I can only do it one time. But I do have tokens. You know what? Oh, uh, how long is... Yep, we've only been going for five minutes. So I was going to save it for a later video, but... I feel bad saving it for a later video when I've only been going for five and a half minutes anyway. So here we go. Another Team of the Week player. What are we going to get? Okay, we get 84 Auto Porter. That's pretty... N How's this man have no 84 overall stats? How, how does how does that make it 84? He's 84 overall... So they, they've reverted back. <laughs> they've reverted back to giving the expensive cards crappy stats. Okay. Okay, good to know. And let's see, we need three more, but I have a bunch of those tokens from the sets that I can throw in. Let's see, so we'll be able to get two gold players, but that's 20 tokens for a gold player! EA, you are killing me right now. You gotta meet me halfway or something. Are the gold players auctionable? I'm really curious. Oh my gosh, even the freaking golds are not auctionable. EA. You've got to do something to help us right now. You're literally giving us nothing. I can do nothing with these players that I get out of the bundles. I literally have no reason to buy bundles. I even want to buy bundles for videos and you aren't giving me a reason to want to buy it. I'll just drop the extra 150 NBA cash to get this elite team of the week player. But EA, y'all got to do something. Meet us. Like halfway, meet us even a tenth of the way, because you're not meeting us anywhere right now. Here we go, another Elite Team of the Week player, and we get another Auto Porter Jr. Apparently, I can have two Auto Porter Juniors on the same team. Why, why did it give me the option to update team? Um, okay, well, that's confusing. So it didn't update team, but we are looking pretty nice. Let's see, do we have any players from like one specific lineup that I could use a lot of? Let's see, we've got two, we got three two ways, three, yeah, we're pretty much split evenly all the way down, so I'm probably going to try to switch up my bench a little bit, although I don't really need the shot block boost all that much, and the plus 3% fans is going to be nice, given the fact that it is incredibly difficult to get fans right now, so I believe that's all that we can do, I guess, we could throw these players, but guys, 10 elite players for an 87 overall that just that just doesn't make any sense to me there's a zero percent chance that i'm going to do that set if any of you guys did do the set and want to let me do some gameplay on your account i would be very thankful for that but there is no chance i'm putting 10 elite players in 10 elite team of the week players in to get demarcus cousins when you've got to play the live event 20 times to get one gold player then you've got to have 20 gold players to get one elite player. So that's 400 times. To get a DeMarcus Cousins for free, guys, you would have to play the live event 4,000 times. Let me repeat that one more time. 4,000 times is how many times you would have to play the live event to get a free DeMarcus Cousins. That is the definition of pay to play. Hopefully EA gets this fixed soon. Honestly, guys, right now, there are some big problems with the game, and EA is refusing to fix them. So I might drop some FIFA Mobile later. Drop a like down below if you guys want to see that. Also, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, and turn on notifications. And I'll see you guys next time.